Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back to our Austrian playthrough in the year 4 with me, your host, Lucky Marine. Let's grab a final claim on France. Now let's bring you back for the time being. Poland and the almonds, that's ridiculous. Well, let's have a look into this. Great Britain would still join. I don't really want to be fine Great Britain. At all. The moment we end up fighting them is that, oh. The moment we end up fighting them is the moment that they turn suddenly hostile and then it'll just be another one on the rivalry list. I think we have enough rivals already. Yeah, I think Lundberg is going to be our best route into it. Wurzburg and Trier. I have no access to you. Now we have no access to you either. We could go to war with you. Just to release some people. If we were bored. Poland would bring in France, but it would only bring in France. We could go into the France and make them annul their alliance with the Ottomans. Why wouldn't you? Spain is in debt. We could pay off your debt. Maintained. Not bold. Fully maintained. So straight away we could take probably a thought of either. Do we still have access there for our? Have we still got that military access or are you just black flagged? So 30,000 towards France, grab that mothball fort, and then get away. 23,000 toward, I think it was Poznan, wasn't it? Grab that mothball fort. Let's crack out. Grab that foot mothball fort in Highlanders as well. Nice. And then double away. I'll grab some more infantry. You hate us, so you're not going to allow us access. Rainsburg will, though. I will snaffle a fort off the French and a fort off the Polish. Okay, okay. <clears throat> And go from there, and we'll see who joins up with who, and how the Spanish get involved if they get involved. Do you, does Spain even have forces in the old world, or is France just going to walk straight into there and kick his teeth in? Are you just pieced out with Creek? What are we looking at? Friends, how many of you got? Do we have the manpower for this? Even Poland's got 35,000 manpower. Hmm. It's 
17 of follower form. Create another policy. Well, if religious unity. How about we've already got a diplo rep going? <clears throat> National unrest, you the prestige, nope, nope. Let's get rid of you two. I'd really like, if we're going to war with France, I'd really like uh, either discipline or morale guy. Discipline will do for when we need him. Saxony, are you getting your poop pushed in? Will people still come and help you? Great Britain will. All right, let's go a long way around it then. You want your entire... Oh my word. <clears throat> well, we'll keep that claim. However, it might end up being another threat and war. No, not same morning. We're getting 16 aggressive expansion. How much can we deal with? Probably not 16. That would put us right on the edge with a few countries. Nope. Disputed succession with. Yeah, yeah. No CB. Now Spain will come in. Why do I not have a CB? Put some spine network on you, bring you back. Let's get a spine network on you as well. Should have already been doing this a long time ago. You're still being a Hmong. Hostile attitude. Okay. Domination. Barden has joined the Catholic League. Uh, obviously. The ring, will you stop eating people? Seriously, come on. That wouldn't be even releasing anybody. Form Alliance, liberate the Croats from the Ottomans. No. Twenty princes for the reform. Come on. Let's not have to get up to seventy this time. Excellent. Yeah, I'll we'll take that. Attack. Fort maintenance, fort defence. Excellent. Plus missionary strength. Always nice. Rebel uprising, Danish separatists. We'll see about that. So, pay that we can only get there if we have access or if we're at war. Nope, 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 nope. Nope, please go away. Merge up all you lot because this is doing my head in. Tensions between nobles and papal state changed by minus 100. Oh, crap. Come on.
It's not even decent terrain. Uh, woods. Not too bad, I suppose. One more tick, and then we'll uh, we'll go for it before it automatically takes the top option for us. I shouldn't have spent the admin points there. I should not have spent the admin points. I just should have allowed it to flip to. You're not going to allow, sir. Oh, you will. I should have allowed it to flip to Protestant because we have the mission strength to flip it back. That was a poor choice there. This is what we should have done before. Instead of losing that 50 admin points, we should have just allowed it to flip. I should have allowed it to flip. Like I keep bringing you into my mistakes. Brilliant diplomat, diplo relations, and aggressive e expansion impact. 20 papal influence, 5 bureau influence. Ooh, 5 bureau authority. Cannot enact reforms during religious conflict. So when does this ever end? Fine. Cannot enact reforms during religious conflict. There is no religious conflict. Look, we've won. We have pretty much won. Apart from fucking Poland and Almonds and Muscovy and... Th these are outside people. These don't count. Popular religion, mission of strength, tolerance, mission of strength. I can't believe this stopped. I can't believe it just. No. Oh. Two heretic princes. What has happened now? Nassau. Nassau has flipped. Somehow we need to get in. And grab Nassau. Who are you mates with? Burgundy, Arnholt, Brandenburg, Munster. How do I get to work with you? There's going to be a way. Arnold. Nope, can't get some. Kind of if we march our way through Saxony. Yeah. Come on, Greybrain, what the hell are you doing? What's the strategic advantage of this for Greybrain? Mm -mm. I don't know. So we're just going to end up grabbing more and more Imperial Authority. And it's, we're not going to be able to do anything with it. Protestant League, but you're Catholic. As are you. As is France, for that matter. Muscovy is an entirely different. Well, you're Catholic as well. Muscovy and the Ottomans are, are just entirely different religion. Well, Ottomans are, but they don't like us. I 
I don't know. I don't get that. Should be able to pass Imperial reforms. Look at the defensiveness till the end of the game. We'll go for that. Propagate claim on Poznan. No, it was Krakow. That the mothball fault. Mothball. Mothball. Mothball, really? Okay. Well, let's go concentrate on the Polish then. Disputed succession. No uh What do I think Muscovite noble? Really? Fairly certain we had a royal marriage with them. Excellent. Excellent. Diplo, we're taking Diplo. Yeah, we're taking the actual Diplo attack. Six months. Off you go. Spain. Wait, 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 wait. First of October. Mothballed, mothballed, mothballed. We can get in there and take three forts off them for nothing. Maybe. Probably. Hopefully. Hmm. Got them. Take Krakow, bring in Spain. You'll get there on the 15th. You'll get there pretty soon. You, with Maneuver General, you'll get there on the 15th. We need to take advantage of multiple forts, but I know it helps. Every little and all that. Alright, air cannons out with Siege Dude to block. You support. You want to give us. Nope. Nope. If it was Condotti area for free, then maybe, but no. Give me something to do with papal authority. Lorraine and Ferrara. Ferrara, what have you done? You've eaten Mantua. You've eaten Mantua and my dinner. Convert this. Spread the Catholic faith. What, what have you got reformed? How far are you through it? We can't tell. No, we'll continue to let him spread the Catholic faith in Chelmna. And 
time. In the meantime, France is here, eating bits and pieces. However, Castile should be busting a gut to get back from the New World and to deal with France. What is this? Thuringia, of course, Thuringia. So your block is over. Great. Carry on. New support. 21% chance. He just rocks up and it's a 21% chance. Love it. <laughs> Alright, carry on. We'll allow this uh, missionary to carry on. The more of the map that we can paint Catholic, the better. Egypt, man. A five siege general, and he's our leader. Wow. Poland doesn't know what happened there. That was, I don't know. Are you allowed to reference Blitzkrieg when you're talking about Poland? I don't think you are. I think it's a bit uncool. But anyway, yearly uh, inflation reduction, we do need that. Start bringing this down fairly aggressively. Um, what I'd really like to do is turn around and go mess up France. Why have we got random stacks here? I don't know. Liberty desire is zero. Oh dear. Well, we'll take the uh, as many forts as we can. We'll leave something for them to chew on a little bit. Um, so that they, there's no way that they're going to be able to siege these forts back as quick as we have been able to siege them. So we'll, we'll leave them a few forts to be uh, to get in the teeth into. In the meantime, we'll switch focus and we'll go siege down France. Siege of Turov. These are just... It's fairly crazy. I don't think at this stage of the game, with this level of cannons, I've ever had such quick sieges. Right, you lot. Let's head over to France. Might leave. I could probably leave the Hungarians here actually. If we grouped up here now, hit the Lithuanians. Okay. Oh come on, Augsburg. Alright, as we're as we're passing. I might go smash the Augsburgians. What what? What? Junior partner of Denmark. What is going on here? Oh, there you are. Be looking for you, Poland. All right, everyone, come back. We'll stack up on Poland. Series down that fault. Are we finished there? Good. Back to being Catholic? Yep. Excellent. 
Or the Ottomans have just let them through. Allowed the military access. Let's go hit the Polish. We need to get rid of this 30 stack. It's going to cause all sorts of issues. Right, you look. Back towards France. You. We'll follow the Austrians around, the Hungarians around. Approve election, yeah. Magdeburg. Approve election with you. I can't, I can't believe we can't take these. I can't believe I can't take these. During the religious thing, the uh, religious um, wars, not during the religious wars, because no war has taken, kicked off. If there was a war going on right now, fair enough, but there isn't. And this can last for 30 years. 30 years, 50 years, just a stalemate of doing nothing. I don't agree with it. to be on me right now. Venice joined the Protestant League. You're not Protestant though, are you, Venice? What are you doing? I don't know, there needs to be more interactions between Overlord and, uh, and vassals or PU partners or you need more control over their forces. Yep, that's fine. But that's where we're going to leave it for today, ladies and gentlemen. Um, grab you. Oh, we've got to the slander merchants point. So for the rest of the game, we're going to have our merchants landed. I can guarantee it. <clears throat> anyway. Blitzed our way through Poland, Lithuania. And I think we should just leave them. All right, you do whatever you want. We should pretty much just leave them to sit on forts and try to take them back because guaranteed, guaranteed that we'll be able to eat our way through France, separate piece them out before Poland's got halfway through on siege his forts. I can't believe that Castile was so shit. One, two, three. For at this rate, Castile's going to get separate pieced out, and uh, France is going to end up taking land off him. Anyway, until next time, do take care.